Hey guys, welcome. Aloha, not Aloha. hi, Aloha. We are in Hawaii, this is Big Island. It is awesome. We just have landed from the flight. And by the way, this is the airport. If you haven't been to Hawaii, this is the airport. Let me show you, let me walk you around. That's the beautiful airport. We have a gift shop right here. We're waiting for the bags and we got a, we got a six hours straight flight direct flight from LA and it's a lovely weather out here. We got a lot of things uh, again scheduled for, for today, tomorrow and like we are here for like full night. It's gonna be fun. So we had the Kila Kikwa Bay. We drove at the bay, uh, there's no activity going on here. I believe it's on the other side. We stopped for lunch and uh, we actually went to Costco. We, we got some uh, pizzas and stuff for the hotel. And uh, now we're heading to Stockholm. We're gonna go to Kahalu Bay after that. But this one has a good, good view actually. And uh, there's, there's a monument uh, down there. Uh, it's called Captain Cook. And that was, that was a crap for you guys. What's up guys, uh, after that beautiful drive, we are here at the Kahalu Beach. And uh, this one is actually a better one as compared to the Kila Kila Kikwa. This one is looks like professional, and uh, they have a lot of snorkelers going around. Check it out. This is the Kahalu Beach Park. Anytime better than the Kila Kikwa. So if you are here next time in Big Island, go for the Kahalu Beach Park for snorkel in Kona. It was amazing uh, snorkeling at Kahalu. You have to do that. You have to do that. So uh, we're heading to um, the White Sand Beach. Uh, I don't know what it's called. It's Kua Bay. So on the road, I, I, I came across this uh, scenic viewpoint. I want to show you this. Just check it out. It's really beautiful out there. at the White Sand Beach. This one is called the Kua Bay. So we have White Sand Beach, Green Sand Beach, Black Sand Beach. Big Island is amazing guys. I'm gonna show you what, what this uh, White Sand is. Uh, look, at, look at this view, this is amazing. Green water with white sand. Sun Beach. This is really beautiful. You have to be here. Just, just check it out. Just check it out. Oh no, my camera. Shit. Oh no, my camera. Oh, my camera just got wet, but uh, should happen. I just uh, put it to dry and hopefully it will work fine. We have big waves coming here, see, check this out, again at the same spot.
really nice beach white sand almost white um not exactly white but whiter than the most of the beaches and green water aloha everyone well that's part of the journey this is june june end of 2017 and it's raining raining down very heavily well, this is the thing about uh, big island and hawaii you cannot predict when it's gonna rain but we have a very good weather out there very good views out there so on the way to the hotel on the hilo side we are stopping over at the hapuna beach this is another uh, the white sand beach uh, on the west side of the big island it is similar to the Kua Bay that we just went but this is nice too and there's actually um, not much people around here right now and the green water with the white sound, uh, white sand is actually awesome like unbelievable just look at that look at this view green water with the sunset as a backdrop on the white sand it's amazing this can't be a better place to spend your evening right correct Alright guys, I'm gonna keep you updated. I'm gonna go and drive to the hotel now. It's gonna be like a one and a half hours drive because we are staying on the Hilo side because there are a lot of activities down there and not on the Kona side. And we're gonna go for the, our next adventure uh, tomorrow. And I believe that's gonna be the Volcanoes. So aloha for today. Aloha. So this is the day two of our trip and uh, this is the hotel that we got on the Hilo. It's the Ocean View side and uh, it looks pretty good from here. The weather is really nice. It's going to be sunny and um, maybe some rain but uh, we got our day especially for the activities. We're going to go for the volcano. We're going to go for the Black Sand Beach, Punalu Beach and the Huli Sea Arc. Uh, the, mostly the day is actually um, full of volcano and the lava. Hopefully it's not going to be shiny, it's, it's going to be like, uh, like gloomy, uh, so it's not going to be like, you know, like, you know sweaty because we're going we're gonna to trail for like uh, four and a half miles. Wow, I don't know what is that, but this, this looks too cool. Is it fog on the ground? Is it cloud on the ground? Is it smoke on the ground? Wow, but it is fantastic. Wow, this is amazing. I never thought of... I never imagined I, I could I, I would see that. Can the view just get better? I don't think so. This is Hawaii. This is Big Island for you guys. That's it, we have made it. So this is our this is our destination. This is the Punalu Beach Park. This is the Black Sand Beach Park. It looks fantastic. Just look at that. Black Sand Beach. I haven't seen a Black Sand Beach in my life. It looks really good. Just, just check it out. I, I cannot see the water color because uh, the beach is actually black in color so I think it's, it's green color water but since the, the, the sand is, is black it appears to be black water but it's, it's really good so while walking on the black sand beach there are a few turtles here and uh, they are sleeping or something I don't know but they are turtles and let me show it to you uh, I'll, I'll try to focus and zoom that in, into the into the video
Aloha people. We have just parked at, uh, at the Lava View Point. It is a Kalapana site. There are two sites uh, and like probably a uh, round trip is like nine miles walk. You can uh, hire uh, a cycle too. They have cycles out there but they're expensive. Like ten dollars per hour per person. And that probably is going to take us like one and a half hour walking. So yeah, we're going to do that. We have just started. And there are lots of people. There are lots of cars. There, everyone is parked out here. Right now it's like 5.30 in the evening. And I think it's, it's, a, it's a good time because yesterday we, we observed the sunset was like uh, 7 or 7 p.m. So we should be able to make it and uh, view, uh, you know, both, both, both uh, time, both views of the lava, like in the uh, day as well as in the night. In the night, the lava looks really cool. I mean, not cool. <laughs> it looks really good. All the red colors show up. And we just, we just started. <laughs> we are about to take our first break. Um, it's really important to take your water break. Uh, it also helps to reduce our weight, bag weight, right? Backpack weight. We're carrying lots of things. Uh, it, it has been a rainy trip, rainy weekend in Hawaii. So we're carrying umbrella, poncho, we're carrying cross light for our way back to return. Um, we're carrying extra, I'm carrying extra towel because I know I, I sweat a lot. And we're carrying food, water bottles. Um, and a jacket and some makeup ah. <laughs> and some uh, and a jacket because it's gonna be cold on the shore so remember to take all of your stuff and uh, and yeah take breaks okay break at number three hawaii volcanoes national park we're gonna take a picture with that Only like 200 people here, not much, but it's worth it. Hello people, good morning, this is day 3 of our trip and we got uh, zip lining to do. It's, uh, since we are staying at the Hilo side, so we have we have um, uh, we have the reservation at the Skyline, which is like very close, like 15 minutes from here. And uh, this is this is actually one of the reasons why I, I, I am staying at the Hilo side because uh, there are lots of things, more things and uh, more things to do than the Kona side. We just had our breakfast and uh, all set for the day. After that, we're gonna. Uh, go for the green sand beach later in the evening and after that we're gonna uh, do the, the Jagger National Museum to see the crater volcano because we, we missed that yesterday we're gonna we wanna complete that today and uh, this is all we, what we have to plan for today time to gear up time to get sunscreen and all set After that adventurous zip lining, we are here at the Rainbow Falls. We are actually covering the falls on the um, Hilo side coast because we have lots and lots and more uh, of them. Check out the beautiful Rainbow Falls.
You need shuttle. Don't even think about getting your own car. Even it is four wheel drive. <laughs> cannot wait, cannot wait. I want to go there. And this is the way to go down there through the mountains it's not too bad it's, it's easy actually once you're in there you will find your way and I'm there wow yep so as you can see this is a green sand beach Papakolia beach it's called the sand is really green in color so we have covered white sand, black sand and this and, and now this which is a green sand beach um, Let me show you If you can see that in the camera it's really a green sand and uh, as I came to know about, about that uh, it's actually um, some kind of chemical that's coming out from, this, um, from the, these, these walls of the crater and uh, it's actually safe so don't, don't worry But yeah, Big Island has lots of things for you if you want to go and check out the waters, you can do that. I'm gonna take uh, some pictures out there and I'm gonna post that. Aloha! And yeah, I forgot to tell you, this is actually one of the four green sand beaches in the world. So there are only, so there are only four green sand beaches in the world. This is one of them. So if you are in Big Island, do check it out. Check out this view guys, after doing the Green Sand Beach, we are now heading to Volcano National Park, we want to go to the Jagger, Jagger Museum because we missed the crater yesterday, we are going to do that today and uh, we are on time, we are going to see the uh, lava in colors in the night, just check out this view, isn't it amazing, like driving on this road with this weather. We finally made it, made it to the Jagger oh, Museum and there is the spot to see the, the Kilauea uh, volcano the, the light you can see in, in front is actually the volcano erupting continuously for the last 30 years 30 plus years this is a crater uh, it's too cold right now and there are lots and lots of stars in the sky I'm gonna try some, some photos and probably paste that let's see what I do Aloha people, day 4 of our trip and it's a beautiful weather, beautiful morning uh, we, we are actually going to the Richardson Park because we are staying at the Hilo side so we are going to do uh, snorkeling again and Richardson Park is actually famous for this snorkeling point and I think they have told us too so I believe Oh yeah by the way, uh, if you see uh, this is a new car, uh, this is a Mustang convertible we are enjoying a new car, we just got a new car upgraded now at the Ahal, Ahal Lamaui Beach Park um, I, I'll post this spelling in the video but uh, this is a hot spring it's uh, close to the Hilo side so this one they actually have like two hot tubs hot springs uh, this is one of them and um, we're gonna check this out 
and after that probably we're gonna have some food or maybe the, an ice cream uh, full of macadamia nuts because those are famous here we have a local vendor selling that uh, behind me and uh, let's check out the uh, hot spring first and uh, and plan out later One word of precaution, um, if you have uh, an, an open wound or like a cut or something on your body, do not enter this pool, uh, do not enter this tub uh, because of um, bacterial infections or something. Uh, it's pretty warm, it's pretty warm. It's actually warm uh, compared to the uh, sea water. Someone, someone at, um, here told me that this water is actually combined with the lava water. So that's why it's warm. And it's, it's a hot spring, uh, you're fine, you're safe uh, if the water gets in your mouth, in your nose, ears or eyes or something. But not good for your wounds and cuts and you know, other things, open open things. But it's pretty relaxing, I'm actually relaxing and so soothes my body. Uh, if you're in Hilo side, check this out. Aha, Lanaui Beach Park, I believe, and I'm gonna post that. So, after returning from the hot spring, uh, we, we got this local window. She was selling some local ice cream. Mm -hmm. this, this one is actually macadamia ice cream and mine is an apple banana. Okay. Um, still actually tasting the macadamia nuts. But um, she, she said that it's uh, like locals are dying for these items. So I want to try that. Probably you should do. Finally, it's time for the Waipio Valley. We are at the Waipio Valley lookout. It's a great, great view. You, you must have seen that in the wallpaper. It's a great view out here and it's a lovely weather too. Aloha people, day 5 and it's time to go, it's, uh, we just woke up and probably in like 30 minutes we, we are head heading back to the airport, we don't want to go, Hawaii is a beautiful place, a big island has everything, I'm loving it, um, I just love everything here, fantastic view, uh, lots of things to do, waterfall, beaches, different color beaches, uh, zip lining, volcano, lava, I mean everything, I, I cannot even think of uh, more things right now. But yeah, sad it's time to go. You have to get back because you never say bye because it's always next adventure. So probably we, we're gonna catch you up in the next adventure uh, somewhere. I don't know, I'm not sure right now, but uh, so aloha, aloha from Hawaii and see you in our next video. Bye.